cakes and By muffins way, and things like that. This is the finished here. product of the honey cake this right here up front. Honey there cake. You can this leave is it right there. You can leave it right every there. Please leave it right there. Russia's on a table. There you go. Next week. There you go. You got that. Good. Now let's go over some of the other things that you have here. Sure. Well, first of all, we have all different types of apples. Now these apples are coming from Johnny Pomodoro's, which is one of the businesses Kosher Michigan certifies. And one tradition on Rosh Hashanah is to actually dip the honey, I'm sorry, dip the apple right into the honey. And uh, we also have, these are no sugar added honey bran muffins from Marty's Cookies in you West Bloomfield. You can leave stuff on, on the plate and just point if you don't mind. I thought you wanted to take no, a no, bite. No, no, we'll get, we'll and, get to it in uh, a second. <laughs> <laughs> and all of these are different pastries, uh, also from Johnny Pomodoro's, different honeys. And uh, this is actually a pomegranate. Now the pomegranate is symbolic for Rosh Hashanah because when we cut it open, there are approximately 613 seeds, the same number of commandments in the Torah. Uh, this is a fish head. We should be like the head uh, on Rosh Hashanah. Now why a fish head? Well, the fish head is really to uh, wish each other that we should be like the head of the new year, uh, to use our intelligence uh, in the coming year. Uh, we also have carrots. A carrot in Hebrew is a gezer, which is sort of like the decree. And on Yom Kippur, mm -hmm. uh, we have the decree from God. Now talk about what you're from Kosher Michigan. Talk about what that is. Well, Kosher Michigan is a kosher certification business. Mm -hmm. uh, we go into restaurants and supermarkets, bakeries, mm -hmm. and we certify them as kosher, which means that all of their ingredients and everything fits the Jewish dietary laws. So it's okay for Jews to eat who keep kosher, mm -hmm. and also for anyone else who keeps kosher. Now do you say happy Rosh Hashanah? You can say Shana Tova, right? That we Shana should have a good, a good year, and you can mm -hmm. also wish people a sweet year and uh, have some of these sweet foods. Mm. So Shana Tova to all my Jewish brothers and sisters out there, and to everyone else, <laughs> they make some really good food on Rosh Hashanah, mm. so go visit your Jewish friends and get something tasty to eat, or go to Kosher Michigan as well. We'll have a link on our website at myfoxdetroit.com.